you guys welcome back to another video today we're in my messy room playing minecraft um so right today i'm building the train from the gree from the g train that green built um i de i definitely did not come up with this design but it's pretty cool so i thought i would teach someone to build it um, I've done this many times, so I know what I'm doing and stuff. Also, yeah, so, uh, this is kind of resource heavy, so you might want not, you might not want to do this in survival. Um, I think that's all I have to say. Let's get into the build. So, I'm going to build half of it, since it's symmetrical um just because i don't feel like building the whole thing um so here we go what you want to start off by doing is um making six um six wide little lane here and then, you're just gonna, like, mine it back, and mine it back some more, and once you think you're far enough, just keep going, because it's kind of a long train, so, I think this is probably good, right here, um, I don't know how to edit, so you're just going to see me do some of the painstaking things in whole. So just six by pretty far, uh, one block deep lane. I have to really reach around the camera to get this. I'm not, normally not this clumsy in Minecraft. Because I am normally this clumsy in real life. Oh, looks like you can't really see it there. Uh, So then, you want to go and get some gravel. You just want to place two gravel like that. And then move one and then place two more, two more gravel in that line like this. And then just continue doing this down the entire path. Okay, then what you want to do next is take this dark oak wood plank and fill in here, between the lines. Oh, I forgot to m mention, this is slightly ar altered from the one that Grian designed. Okay, so then you want to get the slab for that same wood, and then do this pattern here, where you have 
one, then two, then one. So, that's what we should. So once you've done that, you want to grab an your anvil and just face, make sure you're facing this way so it uh, puts the things correctly. And you're just going to want to line it like this. When I'm done with this, I'm going to take a break because I'm hunched over the camera to get this angle, so. Okay, I'm back. So, um, what you're going to want to do now is you're going to get, gonna get coal, a block of coal and then, no, sorry. I mean, I guess you could start with this. Okay, I guess I'll start with this. Um. When I go on the ground, shift so you can place without activating the anvil. I think I set these a little too far here. Just set these a little bit that way. So. I don't want to shift again, so I'm just building off these ones I've already made. Um, so then, what I'm going to do... Oh, yeah. I forgot about only building half of it. So, then what I'm going to do is... You know what? It might, it might actually be easier if I just build the whole thing, so I think I am going to do that. So, then what you want to do is you want to place a stone slab like this, and then you want to go starting from the big one, you want to go 26, so that's already three. So I'm going to go 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22, 23, 24, 25, 26. Okay, and then you want to build off that one like that. And then you're going to put coal in this two apart in every way and then you want you're gonna grab grindstones and put them like this so there you go And then, you want to put, you want to put the same wooden slabs you use to build the tracks, like so, on the thing. And once you've done that, on both sides, You want to put hoppers between the coal and the uh, slabs, like so. So then I'm going to move over here, 
and then messed up here. Got to rebuild a little. So then you want to grab a um, spruce fence gate and you want to um, put along the edges like this. So, right here, you have the, um, if you're, if you're just, like, looking for the very base of a train car, this is the point you're in now, but I am going to also show you how to make an old wooden train car look, like a passenger car. So, um, what you want to do if you're doing that is you're going to get this, 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 um, and then this, and this. So, these are the stuff to make the thing. So, what I usually start off with this is I place pistons like that, and then levers on the coal block next to that. And that's going to make the couplers. So then after that, I start by going and putting upside down, sorry, upside down stairs. Um, like so. Along the entire edge, stopping at the pistons. Okay. I'm going to do that again. Okay, so after that, what you're going to do is you're going to go um, and grab the oak planks, and you're just going to fill in everything, and then place two blocks over the lever, and um, piston, and be very careful not to try to place directly on blocks directly on this fence because if you do it's going to be a pain to get them closed again So there you go. Um, what you want to do now is you want to grab the spruce wood planks um, and go up. Got to count here. Um, I've never counted it, even though I know how many to place. So. 
uh, five up. So like that. So then what you want to do, I think it was six actually. So then you're going to go like one, like that, and then two above them. One like that, then two above them. So then you want to go from this edge to the other edge. There you go. Okay, so then after you do that, um, you fill in with this dark wood. All these, um, like all the walls, but not the roof. All the walls, but not the roof. So, I am going to cut the camera and do that. Okay, so I just finished that. Um, I forgot to add to leave a little doorway right here. Um, so after you've done that, then you want to um, grab your deep slate brick and make a little roof so then this is where your stairs come in you're gonna put the stairs like so I hate when stairs are stubborn like this. They just won't go to the correct place. Like, there we go. Ugh. Like this. Like it's, it just keeps going upside down, no matter way, which way I face it. And if I face it upside down, it still goes upside down, obviously. It's just like, how does it want me to face it backwards? Still goes upside down. So, oh, I finally got it. Okay, I think that's, I think that's it. Um... I forgot how to make the interior, so, yeah, oh, um, go back to here, undo that, and flip the levers. So, there it is, um, oh, and right here, place light sw uh, square, I mean stairs, so like, if you build another plant train next to it, um, make sure that these two piston ends touch, and that, um, the, uh, stairs touch, so you can jump between t trains. So there it is, uh, the final, the tutorial on how to build a train car. Uh, leave a like and subscribe, I guess. Bye!